Uh, nice to meet you. Uh, I'm Takayuki Miyoshi from Japan, and I'm wearing uh, punk wapu. Yeah, do you know? Uh, this is a uh, yeah, word camp uh, t shirt. <laughs> okay, uh, I'd like to talk about the future of Contact Form 7. Do you know Contact Form 7 plugin? Yes. yes. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, <laughs> And I'm Takayuki, I'm Prangui developer, and this is my profile page. And uh, uh, three years ago, I uh, had a speech in uh, WorldCamp Singapore. This is my video. Uh, and I'm from Fukuoka, Japan. Fukuoka is here. And uh, Fukuoka is known as the birthplace of WAPU, original WAPU. Do you know that? Uh, in 2011, uh, a designer in Fukuoka made the uh, original WAPU. Then it's growing. And I'm traveling now uh, for World Camps. Uh, last week, I went to Jakarta for World Camp Jakarta. And then next month, uh, in Philippines, Cebu World Camp and uh, Kota Kinabalu in Malaysia. So I'm traveling now. Okay, uh, I released the latest uh, major version, Contact Form 7, 5.1, uh, last December. And this version is the final major update for the plugin. Final. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, uh, yeah, of course I will release a uh, minor update for security fix or uh, yeah, other bug fix, minor bug fixes. But uh, contact form 7.5.2 won't come. Why? Right. Um, because I'm on another project. So I want to introduce the project uh, project name is Contactable I.O. Uh, what does this, uh, what the Contactable I.O. address is? Uh, it's not about uh, WordPress plugin. It's not about WordPress. Uh, it's about uh, general web forms. It uh, solves problems in thinking web forms. What problems? Uh, now, uh, there are technology called cross-origin resource sharing, CORS. Uh, with CORS, you can uh, submit, uh, submit a form to different origin. I mean, uh, yeah, like this. With a CORS, this is uh, the usual form works. Uh, so, uh, this is a web server, and user access this web server, and this web server provide form, and this guy input into the form, uh, and submit the form data into the same server, right? <laughs> but with CUR CRS, you can submit into different server. Yeah, uh, mm -hmm. this can be possible with the CORS technology, but there is a problem. Uh, you need a validation when you use a form, right? So, is this email address is cor in correct format or, yeah, text language is proper? Yeah, every uh, validation uh, works, but when the, uh, you submit to the same domain. Of course, this server knows how to validate. But when you submit to different domain B server, this domain B server doesn't know how to validate. This is what my new project, Contactable IO, resolved. And um, how? Uh, uh, I make uh, 
a schema sharing, uh, shared by these A and B domains. I called it, uh, I named it uh, contactable I.O. schema. And uh, I haven't developed it, and it's, uh, this is just the explanation. Uh, CIOS uh, uses JSON LD technology. And other uh, technologies. Um, how many people are uh, developers? Not uh, so many. <laughs> yeah. um, uh, I use Cloudflare workers and MongoDB and Osdero and uh, uh, finally uh, I connect from uh, each contact form seven site, each each form is each form to uh, this contactable I/O. Uh, contactable I/O is a uh, kind of API service I'm uh, developing now for other reference implementation for the project. Uh, maybe I can show you uh, by the end of this this year, maybe. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's it. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs>